Hey everybody, this is Caesar with Small Engine Velocity and welcome to another Ruckus install video. Today we're going to go ahead and try to put these front brackets for front foot pegs on the Honda Ruckus. Uh, I went ahead and got some new hardware for it, uh, black and Allen wrench, uh, some new pegs that go sideways into here so they can sit up at the front. Uh, these were used and when I did the power coating recently I had these powder coated black. I got my Allen wrenches, some short wrenches, my drill bits, the hammer drill and some clamps to see if I can hold it down. Now I think these might be a little bit too long for the uh, for the supports that go into here but we'll see. I don't know if it'll interfere with the tank or not but um, let's see. Let's go ahead and Take all this stuff out, take the tank out, and go ahead and kind of start spot positioning where we want to put it. What's going on guys? So I'm gonna just go over with what Caesar just did. First he first he unhooked the gas tank cover and then took the gas tank out and then see the plastic pan underneath over there. And then he had me stand behind and take some uh, clamps and line up these thingamabobbers, this one and then this one for his front pegs because he wants to be cool like me and copy me and do my front pegs. It's way more comfortable. All right, so Caesar, tell me, what do you do now? So the first thing we're gonna go ahead and do is get the, the drill, drill the pilot holes to bump out these down and then use the, the new hardware that we got to bolt it down. And that's pretty much it. Then after that, we just put the front pegs up here so that we have uh, something to put our feet on in the front so that we can be cool like uh, poke my toes. Because apparently this is uh, a cool factor plus five. It's way more comfortable. Yeah. Yeah, there are situations where I feel like that I could put my feet on the front pegs like in traffic or whenever I'm going slower or something like that. I could put my feet here and be cool. Plus rolling into a parking lot at a car show, it's cooler to put your feet in the front and like just kind of instead of being hunched over and crunched in uh, ninja tuck mode. So let's go ahead and drill these holes and get it ready for production. Okay, so the uh, bolts that hold it down to the frame were too short, no, too long, and then there's a little uh, non-threaded portion on the bottom, like that. See the non -thre So we're gonna look and see if we can get it without this part, and then a little bit shorter on this side. And today's special guest, Poked by Toast, aka Puck, is gonna go and drive to the hardware store and change them for us. Everybody give him a round of applause. Clap hands, clap hands. <laughs> All right, be back in just a second. While we are waiting, we're gonna go ahead and mount these on. Uh, I already got one on, but I didn't mount it permanently. I uh, just uh, fitting it. But this, uh, I got an Allen wrench or the inside of this, see? So it's easier to uh, to turn, because I tried to put a bolt in there once and it didn't work out so good. And then, uh, 
put it on with a washer in the back. I don't know why I have a washer, but I do anyway. And there you go. And then once we get it fitted onto the bike, oh wait, <laughs> got it backwards. <laughs> oh my gosh, I swear. Things I do would be like twice as fast if I just pay attention to what direction I'm putting things in. I'd like to thank uh, Texas Get. He's the one who sold me these, uh, these brackets. I'll put a link in the description below where you can buy these. Um, and then I bought some Amazon uh, foot pegs that were black. I didn't buy the JP, the the Password JDM. I mean, they're all pretty much the same. They're beveled. Um, and there you go. The two front foot pegs. Waiting for Poke by Toast to get back. The weather is really starting to get really dark outside, so hopefully he doesn't die. And uh, if everything starts to go worse, we're going to go ahead and move into the garage. Alright, so now that we got the bolts, we're gonna go ahead and mount this on. Let's let's be quick about it. So, for those of you that are curious, this is what a frame-mounted front peg looks like. Uh, I like it less weight, but it sticks out a little bit, so I, I might have to adjust it someday just in case I get a bigger tire, but there's no interference on there, and it looks pretty good. So let's go ahead and finish putting this back together. Okay, well, I went ahead and aired off the bike with the compressor and put the uh, bolts back onto the tank cover, and there they are. There are the front pegs. So when I'm riding, I can put my feet up at the front. Da, 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 like that. And be all pimp with my front pegs. Uh, I like the way it looks. It's good. Um... They're a little wet and uh, they're not crooked or anything so that's good so uh, yeah yeah I wasn't gonna let rain uh, stop this one uh, there's been a lot of rain this weekend I apologize everybody uh, so I couldn't get any of the rides or the installs that I wanted to do uh, and then at the same time my washer drip broke and had to get that replaced and then I had and my wife had two uh, emergency teeth extracted from her mouth so yeah that's not uh it, it's been a busy weekend but anyways i hope you guys enjoyed like subscribe i'll have a link down below for these pegs if if i can find them somewhere and uh you can buy them if you want anyways thank you and i'll see everybody in the next video